Alright, how's it going? And welcome back to the Curtis Price channel. Today we are indeed going to be talking about a YouTube conspiracy. And if you know me, I love conspiracies. I've actually been trying to solve the disappearance of my dad for the last 20 years. Um, so if you've seen them, let me know. <laughs> I'm just kidding, he's out on watching TV, don't worry about it. However, today's conspiracy is about the disappearance of an individual. A woman who was allegedly starved and then forced to eat mukbangs. An individual who had remained blindfolded and appeared with a very strange unsettling energy. That woman is known as Kate Yep. Sounds a bit of a scary video, but don't worry. I'll be here to comfort you along the way. I am indeed the biggest chad after all, as everyone says. <laughs> That's what I like to believe anyway. Now, not many people have spoken about this topic recently, considering it's one of the biggest YouTube conspiracies. It's as if everyone has forgotten about it, pushed it under the rug. So, I believe in this video, I can promise you curiosity, entertainment, and fear. I am the fear. Be afraid of me. Rawr. <laughs> Sorry, that, that was very mature and just, yeah. But uh, get comfortable, grab a snack and a beverage, and without further ado, let's go somewhere where no other person would dare walk. Welcome to No Man's Land. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's start off with a backstory. Because just like me, you're wondering, who is Katie? Yeah. Well, lucky for you, I am the man with all the answers. Unless you're asking questions about the female body, then uh, you've lost me. But Kate Yup is a YouTuber who blew up in 2018 from posting how fast can I eat seafood ASMR mukbang videos. Now that was a mouthful. Well, that's what she said. In these videos, Kate would remain blindfolded through the entire video, with complete silence. However, these videos would accumulate a mass amount of views, which did indeed skyrocket her channel just under a million subscribers. Now, as we know, the mukbang industry uh, is a very strange, dark area. Although there is a lot of money to be gained there and a lot of subscribers, there also comes a lot of controversy as well. As we know, if you haven't seen my last video, Go and watch it, Amblin Reed. But uh, just taking a quick glance at her channel quickly, um, I think we should just investigate and uh, see what's going on. All right. Oh. That uh, that really wasn't the right tab, was it? That right there, ladies and gentlemen, is five kilograms of salmon being consumed in a matter of 15 minutes. <laughs> wow. If you want to wait to comparison, just imagine going to the gym as you do, lifting 5 kg dumbbells. If you do that, you are extremely weak and pathetic. But five kilograms of salmon is a lot, especially for 15 minutes. I don't even last that long in bed. But as we can see, ladies and gentlemen, Kate eats in a very inhuman-like way. See, this is where we have to play detective. How does one act when they're trying to be too dramatic? Hmm, yeah, no, it seems too real. It's too simple, the way she's devouring the food. It can't be. It can't be fake. How would one act if they haven't eaten food in days? And it seems like just a privilege to have food in the first place. Right there. Uh, this is actually, uh... Mascara, funny enough. Um, I won't be putting that on anytime soon. But judging by the way she is digging into her food, it would seem very much as if she hasn't had a meal in days. She doesn't seem to care how much mess she's making. All she wants to do is continue to eat and get as much food down as possible. But keep in mind, this is not a fact. These are just conspiracy theories. I mean, it's just the fishy digging for me. Ew. The room after probably smells like private regions that haven't been washed in days. And we're all asking, does it really get worse than that? I don't know. Maybe we should ask my mother. <laughs> no. Your, your mother. Damn it. However, that was just one video. As the videos got on, she would devour and swallow faster and faster. <laughs> That's what she said. But, ladies and gentlemen, above all jokes, it is indeed unsettling. And this is just the very beginning 
of the unanswered questions. As more videos were being released, a lot of her viewers began to notice strange bruises on her arms. Also cuts on her face. In this case, the cut appeared on her lower lip. In my opinion, I believe Kate was being abused. Starved until it was time for a new mukbang episode, which would explain why she was eating faster every video. This is potentially someone who was forced to keep quiet unable to cry for help. Whoever was behind the camera, I guess you could say they had a lot of power over her. A manipulator, an abuser, and someone who does not care about hurting others. Anision, is that you? <laughs> it's not, it's not, all right, please, I, I don't, there's a joke. But just imagine for a second that if it actually was Anision behind the camera and my joke was actually correct, if that ever happens, I would run down the street naked, bollock naked. <laughs> Actually, I'd probably do that anyway. Not sure how that would go down in a child-friendly neighborhood, however. I don't really want to find out either. But a lot of her audience did indeed get very suspicious and actually came out with a theory that she'd been kidnapped and held hostage to make mukbang YouTube videos. But imagine being kidnapped and being forced to make mukbang videos. I honestly couldn't think of anything worse than making mukbang videos. But believe it or not, ladies and gentlemen, she did actually respond to these claims on her community tab. And this is what she had to say. But before we do that, ladies and gentlemen, you know what I'm going to say, right? Subscribe to the channel, everyone. Let's get to 100,000 subscribers before the end of February. If we can do that, that will be epic. And also, the channel memberships are now active. They've been active for a while, but this is the first video that the channel memberships actually come alive. Like, this is the first video that's going to be released one day early. So if you want to be a member, you will get this video one day early before everybody else. Doesn't that sound like a privilege? Where's my money, bitch? Where's my money, bitch? But let's try and get 3,000 likes in this video. Leave a comment for the algorithm. What did Kate Yup say? Hello, everyone. It's urgent to clarify my situation. Everything is okay for me. Nobody is forcing me to eat and I have any health problem. These marks on my arms are caused by the sun. Just like this womb on my lip, usually called herpes. I love what I do, be sure. Thanks, you. Full peace and love for you. Now, the sun. Yeah, right. That's bullshit. But the question has to be raised. Is it a cover-up? Is she being monitored of what she's posting on social media? That would make a lot of sense. But the sun, I mean. This kidnapper, wherever he is, must literally have the mind of a child. <laughs> Alleged kidnapper. We don't actually know what's going on. But seriously, if she needed help, uh, code words would be a good way to communicate. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is exactly what Kate done. Now, in one of Kate Yup's videos, there was definitely some strange messages appearing during the video. The meat is so delicious, soft, and tender. <laughs> what? But in this sentence, you can see some letters that are written in uppercase midway through the sentence. Either there is a hidden message, or the person that wrote this typed it with their toes. Feet fingers. Okay, now. But look closely. S-O-S. This stands for save our souls. Most people use S-O-S as a sign of help or someone that's in danger. And to be honest, I don't really find it hard to believe that there is something very, very strange and bad going on with this girl. But then, ladies and gentlemen, this happened. Every letter is made up of dots and dashes. Now, Kate Yep's audience seem to think that this is Morse code. Strange tapping in a certain sequence continuously. Once again, this translated to SOS. A cry for help, perhaps? Is she in danger? Well, that is exactly all the questions that we're all asking. And the worst thing about this is that we have no idea who she is, apart from the fact that we know her name is Kate Yep. We've never seen her face, we've never heard her voice. But once again, there was indeed more signs. In another video that Kate posted, at the beginning of each sentence that popped up in the video, each word at the beginning of the sentence was uppercase. And if you put the first letter from each sentence together, it does indeed form the word help. Now that for me is enough to make me feel like something concerning is going on here. But maybe it stands for something else. Hello everyone licking Poonani. Yes, hello, I am here. <laughs> but I ask, can anyone figure my message out? Uh, yeah, this right there. If you can figure it out, then leave a comment. But now, ladies and gentlemen, I think it is time to take you to the man who we haven't seen in several months. We're gonna discuss teeth being pulled out. Uh, also, 
creepy, threatening voices in the video. And thinking of that alone already has given me an asthma attack. But it is time for the Arcane of Sin. Welcome to the other side. How in the fuck are you about to say the way that we do it is not the way? How in the fuck are you about to say the way that we do it is not the way? Welcome ladies and gentlemen, my name is the Arcane of Sin and this is where we're going to dissect Katie Yap's career. Now you've seen all the conspiracies of Katie Yap, you've seen all the horrors within her videos. Most of her audience believes that it is kidnapping. Some believe she is doing this for controversy, just like Marina Joyce. Now Marina Joyce did this a few years ago where she created her own narrative and everyone believed it. She made it seem as if she'd been kidnapped, being held hostage, bars placed on the window, strange noises during videos. And this is why some people believe that Katie Yap's story is all made up. However, you've seen some things that has unanswered questions. But, have you seen this? Well, as you can see, ladies and gentlemen, two of Katie Up's teeth fell out while she was eating fish. This is very strange behaviour. Why would this happen? Why would she post such a video? These are all conspiracies that we have yet to understand. And it's a very disturbing thing to watch, watching a mukbang YouTuber and her teeth literally fall out right in front of everyone. I'm having an asthma attack again. <laughs> Now it was indeed sick enough, and this definitely caused a lot of concern for her audience. Was she being abused perhaps? Was she being beaten? Is this why her teeth fell out? All strange questions that have yet to be answered till this day. However my friends, that's not the end of Katie Up's story. In one video there appeared to be some strange, strange noises happening while Katie Up was filming. Very, very strange indeed. It's, it, it, it's almost as if it's not real. But at the same time, it feels very real. It's hard to explain. Strange noises as in words. Grunting. One of the sentences that was whispered was, I'm going to kill you. Now, uh, this seems like a horror film. And the arcane of sin is very scared. This is, this is weird. But why don't we take a look at this clip for ourselves, ladies and gentlemen. Now, if this is real, it's definitely very, very high cause of concern. But if it's not, I would just want to say that this is extremely sick. That someone would make such a narrative up to worry everyone. To make all of her fans panic. But at the same time, it, it just does seem so real. Now, we're all asking the same question. Does the arcane of sin masturbate? Well, just like Katie Yep's story, questions. That have no answers. But my thought process within this story are these three things. One, she has genuinely been kidnapped. She is being abused by an abuser. And she is being forced to make mukbang videos and being starved every single week without food. She's blindfolded. She doesn't speak. We don't know what she looks like. Two, Kate Yap is faking all of this for attention. She accumulated millions and millions and millions of views off this. And now she's just left the YouTube scene. She's made her money and she's left. Why was she blindfolded? Because she doesn't want anyone to know who she is. Therefore, she can't be held accountable for anything. All three, she hasn't been kidnapped, but she is in an abusive relationship. And she actually genuinely does enjoy filming these videos. But her boyfriend abuses her, which would explain the, the marks on her face, the lip bite, the lip bite. That's a sexual thing. The bruised arms, that would explain it. But let me know in the comment section, ladies and gentlemen, what you think is happening. That is my opinion, and it's, about, it's one of the things that I think. I'm not sure which one, but it could be anything. So, without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, I will see all of you in the next video. Don't forget to sign up to the channel membership. Peace! You mad, bro? Uh, yeah. I said, tell me what you mad for. Uh, you mad, bro?